She is the funniest, warm-hearted, strongest little girl I know. For Peyton Richter, tonight isn't about surgeries or another trip to Boston Children's Hospital. Tonight is about wishes. Your wish to go to Hawaii. You're going to Hawaii. She just found out the Make-A-Wish Foundation is granting her wish to travel with her family to Hawaii. Somewhere warm so she could swim with some animals. It's hard to believe just by looking at her, but since she was three, now seven-year-old Peyton has suffered multiple seizures every single day. Now, after two brain surgeries, Peyton is finally seizure-free, a wish come true for her parents. She carried us through this because we were, me and mom were scared, but she was the little trooper and just went to tackled it all head on. And tonight, Peyton will tackle the captain's chair on board the Andrew McAllister tugboat as she steals the show during the parade of lights. Oh, I think we're pretty cool. Peyton's family was invited on the tugboat by president of Portland Tugboat Company, Brian Fournier. Brian understands firsthand what Make-A-Wish families have been through. The foundation was there for his family when his daughter Alicia faced debilitating epilepsy. Since then, he's been a board member for Make-A-Wish Maine. Whatever a child is going through at that time, whatever hardship a child is feeling, it goes away for that short period of time. Whether you're on the wish or in, thinking about going on the wish or um, at the wish, they forget about their ailment or their sickness for that short period of time. For a father that has seen his daughter go through so much, it's hard for Pat Richter not to worry about Peyton's future. I'm still leery every single day thinking that she's going to have a seizure. You never know with, with having seizures for so long that all of a sudden they're just going to come back. And so I, I'm, I'm still afraid. But tonight, Peyton is simply a little girl with a heart full of wishes. In Portland, Katie Bavoso, News Center.